Hello, YouTube. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Riding Scared of Fishing. Today, we're going to be hunting the you know, Hey, shut up! Bird. Today, we're going to be live bait fishing for the elusive clown knife fish. This fish looks like an alien and it will put you in the hospital for sure. So we're gonna go get some shiners right now. Come along with me, guys. <laughs> Come on, this is a clown knife fish. Or a gun knife have some clowns. They're jumpy dogs, so I have to do that. Boom! It's time to go catch some fish. <laughs> Alright guys, so we made it to the spot. I'm just running a little free line here. About 8 pound braid to 20 pound leader. And a nice small little J hook. We're just going to free line some shiners and hopefully get scooped up by a clown. Just tying a little uni to uni knot right here. I like to do probably 12 twists with the braid. Or until I feel like it, it's good enough. And that's probably good right there. Cinch that. Then I'm gonna do the mono side. Probably about half the amount I did with the braid. Perfect. Cinch it, but not too tight. And then, and then you really cinch it. That's good to go. All right guys, I'm gonna sting a peacock real quick. Check it out. Grab one of these frisky little mullet right here. Finger mullet is what we're using today. Oh, okay, that's good. That's a good one. Hook them up. All right, check it out. Oh, oh yeah. Oh my god, it's a big one. Good fish, good fish. What is that? Oh, big pea. Look at that follower on it, Davis. Oh, there's one double in size right next to him. Look at that, you see him? Oh my god. That's a good fish. Nice little lake eyed peacock. Nice little healthy peacock. There's a much, much bigger one in that dock though, so we're gonna go try to get him. Take the hook on out. Give her a release. Oh, that's This 10 pound, 8 ounce peacock right now. Oh. Down your water, please. You're gonna be looking good now. Hey. <laughs> But on a real note, it was a challenging day here on the water. We tried to get some clowns, they were rolling, but as you can see, and as you can probably hear, the wind. Right at the intercoastal, and we're in one of these bands. So guys, we fed the fish. I'm getting kind of hungry. I think we're gonna go get some dinner. And uh, we're gonna bring these shiners here, and wait till you see what we're gonna feed them. Guys, we'll see you at the restaurant. We made it to Tiki in Jupiter, Florida. We got our shiners in the bucket. We're gonna go in there with the bucket. Maybe get some weird looks, but who cares? We're about to do a snook feed. It's going to be epic and get some fire food. So guys, follow me. Well, we can't feed shiners to the snook tiki, but we can't feed them shrimp. Well, we came to the shop, and I had the intention of actually buying these shrimp, but everywhere in Jupiter is actually low on shiners right now. So when I told them I had shiners, I have 11 to be exact, without a doubt, 
we, we bartered. We actually traded shiners for shrimp. Pretty dope. So we got two dozen shrimp for those 11 shiners, which in my books is pretty sick. And I think it's actually really way sicker feeding these shrimp to the snook because they swim backwards and the snook murk shrimp there. So we asked for a jumbo shrimp and um, Jupiter Bay Taco delivered. <laughs> Guys, look at the size of this shrimp. Should we keep him for a catching cook? Well, you don't kill it before you. Here. Yeah, true. Sure. Thank you, my man. I appreciate it. Now let's try this again. Let's try this again. All right, guys, we're gonna give him another shrimp. Let's see if it happens. I would love for him to just pop it. You gotta take, oh, yep, 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 yep. Come on. Come on, come on. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Yeah. The depth. Oh my god, that thing just opened Whoa. his mouth. Did you see that? I Ooh. think it's so big. Yeah, this thing is huge. Oh my god. Oh, come on, it's not. Get stabbed. Uh oh. Well, guys, looks like it's time to eat, so we're gonna go eat and then come back and give the rest of these shrimp to these fish. Whew. That was fire. You guys ate, and we are going to feed the fish. Those big ones right on top, those are called chubs. You usually find them when you're fishing on the reef, they'll be right in your chum slick. We also have some catfish right there, they're hanging out right in front of that light, and um, right here. All along this, those are snook. You can tell by the predominant lateral line. They have the most defined lateral line of all fish. Fun fact. And uh, let's give a, a little shrimp to the chubs, see if they eat it. Oh, oh yeah, dude, did you see that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I can't even count all of them. They're just snook everywhere. And as you can see, it is actually an outgoing tide. So water from the river is getting swept all the way out there through the inlet. But this is honestly crazy to just watch these snook eat whatever is flowing through. Whether it's glass minnows, mullet, pilchards, or shrimp, whatever is flowing through, these snook are just waiting here to ambush them. And they like to, to sit around these lights so they can see what's coming through. And these lights out also attract lots of bait for them to uh, ambush. So super cool stuff. We got some chubs on top of the water. What else we got? A nice little snook right there. Little jacks that just keep coming and eating all the stuff. And all these chubs, check them out. Look at that on bottom, bro. You see those on bottom? So big. All these dark spots on the bottom are big snook. Big snook, big snook. We call those logs because they sit on the bottom. They look they like a log. Move, just like a log. Just like a log. They just sit with the tide and chill. And those guys are waiting for the big baits to come through, like the mullet or whatever, or that jumbo shrimp that we have in there. Those things would murk that, dude. Yeah, let's, let's throw some of these shrimp at them and let's see what happens. It should not take too long. We got our shrimp. Oh, he's on it, he's on it. He's on it, it's drifting through. It's drifting through, it's drifting through. Oh my God, he just murked it off camera. I'm gonna throw it in front of that one, ready? Not quite. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yes. We got we got one to eat it. That was sick. Oh my god. 
All right, guys, so that's it for today's video. Again, thank you for all the support. If you're new to the channel, my name is Ryan. I make crazy fishing videos. So go ahead and subscribe to the channel, guys. Let's keep growing. It's gonna be an epic year full of fishing content that you don't wanna miss out. Go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you like what you see. Also, comment below. If you guys comment something cool, maybe I'll do it. Also, don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you get notified when I post on YouTube. But that's it, guys. Until the next video, I'll see you and keep on fishing.